Hello Internet, welcome to day 6 of Project 30. Wow, day 6. And today I'm going to talk about why is it so hard to break into the YouTube like market and stuff? Because from what it looks like, you have you had to be there on day one to get to where you are now, but that's probably a misconception. But before I get into that, I am going to lay some information and factoids to you. Information, science mode, activate! <laughs> Yes, this is my information on science mode. Now, some facts there you need to know about YouTube before we get on with what we're going to be talking about. There are over 800 million users to visit YouTube each month. Over 4 billion hours of YouTube videos are watched in a month. That, that, that's a, a little over. That's just, that's just a bit over, I, I think. Just a bit. So really, we are wasting four billion hours of our lives watching YouTube videos. Uh, oh well. 72 hours of YouTube content is uploaded every minute. Wow. 72 hours. And I'm part of that little bit. That, that's, that's, that makes me feel part of something. That's pretty cool. 70% of YouTube traffic comes from outside the US. So, me and the rest of the world. So yeah, we're the 70%. YouTube is localized in 43 countries and across 60 languages. So, pretty much everyone in the world can watch YouTube videos. That's cool, I guess. Information, yeah, yeah. In 2011, YouTube reported one trillion views. So that's about 140 views per person. So. We are really wasting our lives on the internet, yay! Oh, yes, those are some factoids about YouTube you might want to know or you didn't know, so yeah. And these all came from the YouTube stats page on that they offer. So if you think I'm telling the, a lie, you should go check it out. I will put it in the description so you can see my resources. Now, to normal mode, go! <laughs> So yeah, those are some factoids I thought I'd lay on you before I start talking about why it might be hard to break into the YouTube market. <laughs> As you've just heard, there are a ridiculous amount of videos being uploaded every single day. So I think to get yourself noticed on the internet, you need to be random and flamboyant and something different, but something that no one else has done yet, but that's hard now, but you got to think of something original. Like, I'm not actually, I didn't, this is more of a um, kind of precog to something else. So I'm, my inspiration for Project 30 actually came from Chris Bing's past Bing and future Bing. That, that's where this, this original idea came from, where he's having a conversation through time about, through him, a conversation through time with through him over a year or so, I thought, hey, I could do something like that, but I won't do a conversation between, through time. So, this is what I'm doing. It might not be the best thing, and it probably will only last for September, so I don't know what I'll do after September. But, if you're gonna make it on the internet, take it from someone who's just starting, you gotta do something different. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to do something different in a bunch of different things, because I've only just started, so, yeah, I hope, I hope this somehow has helped people who are just starting as well, like me and everyone else, maybe even inspired a couple of people, maybe. So, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you tomorrow. TTYL Internet.